so guys i just added uh the this thing so if you love what you're seeing why not give it a thumbs up wow our native soup is ready so you can now bring it down and serve it uh with semo Welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm Jabless Azubike. Um, <laughs> thank you for returning back. Today we are to learn how to cook native soup, and we are making use of uh, coconut instead of our uh, ofo, uh, which is the normal one you're used to. So, guys, um, I'll be using coconut uh, in cooking this native soup. So, guys, um, I did a video on uh, the simple um way of cooking native soup and i will leave uh the video link on the description box uh yeah that video link on the description box so you can go watch it and kind of uh do a comparison between both of them which is this one and uh the other one i made the video um that video if you check it has been growing uh, it has having uh, like uh, natural views like i love it but there's no really engagement i don't really see comments on it so uh, that's one thing that i'm kind of uh, i don't really i love seeing comments and uh, likes you know that so guys um if you're just joining us on can tv the, for the first time please just do it to subscribe welcome to the family this family uh can tv family is one of the biggest family that we have a whole lot of content to show you guys uh we have a whole lot of content in it so guys you will enjoy this family so just click the red subscription button okay guys so we have to go to the kitchen <laughs> okay guys let's go so guys these are the ingredients that we are to use um in cooking our native soup yeah so i'm going to be listing them now this is our praying coal you to use periwinkle, you're used to this. Oh, uh, okay. This is our uh, crayfish. You have to use crayfish. So, these are uh, smoked fish. This is smoked fish. Smoked fish that we have to use. If you like this video, or if you like what you're seeing, please give this video a thumbs up. Yeah. Okay. Then we are going to use a uh, red pepper. This is our red pepper. These are onion. You have to use onion. This is um kanda. You have to use kanda. These are Cameroon pepper. No magi. Salt. Kukunyam. We have to use uh kukunyam as our thickening. Instead of us using um ofo, we have to make use of um kukunyam for our thickening yeah this is the leaf that we have to use um this is a uh, of ziza leaf you have to use a ziza leaf these are stock fish and our uh, beef we have to use beef red beef and these are palm oil so guys i'm going to show you the process now what we have to do now is just to like watch some of the ingredients i put it inside the pot then we have to just boil them for some minutes for them to like to be soft so guys we have to wash our fish our smoked fish just remove the bone wash it properly because of sand you wouldn't want to eat sand okay guys um these are remaining fish the dry smoked fish or drop <laughs> smoked fish or dry fish anyone whichever way you call it though so we just have to wash this again Remove the head. Just 
There is too much bone in this fish. I don't know why I bought this fish. I don't think I can even remove this fish. Give me a tough time. So, hello guys, these are Pomo or uh, Kanda, whichever way you call it. So, I have to like chop this in, do I call it pieces or cube? Okay, whichever way. We just finished, uh, finished slicing the this thing. The, the Pomo. So, what we have to do is just to add some of the ingredients. This is our Cameroon pepper. Add the Cameroon pepper. We add one of the non Maggi cube, a seasoning cube, non Maggi. No Maggi. Salt, a little bit of salt. Be careful of your salt because most of the things that are here they are very salty too. So just mind. Just have to cook this for about. 30 minutes but we're going to add water we we'll just have to wait for some few minutes before adding the water have to try it. so guys as you can see we have to add some water this one is okay So, sorry guys, I'm to add onion. This for some few minutes. Okay guys, so, as you can see, boiling, so, all we have to do now just add water the quantity of water that we want for our soup just have to add the quantity of water that we want for our soup so guys remember i told you that we had to use uh coconut as our tikina we're going to use coconut uh as our tikina uh we are not going to use or for the one you know as or for yeah what we have to use is coconut. So we are just going to slice this. Just are going to slice this and put it in a pot. Put it in a pot. Cook it for it to be soft. Then we blend it or pound it. If you have a blender, you can blend it after cooking. So guys, I just finished uh, peeling the this thing, the cocoa So I just have to wash it, put it in a pot, then add some water, then put this, put this in the bowl. Light to cook for about. 20 or 30 minutes when it gets soft so that we can just blend it uh, let's just check if it's ready okay it's now soft so we just have to bring it down blend it or pound it but i'm going to pound mine 
So guys, this is how it looks like after pounding your cocoa yam. Either you pound it or you or you blend it. This is how it looks like. I just finished pounding it. Look at how it is. I have to pound it very well. As you can see, that's how it looks like. So let's go back to our pot to check what's happening there. So I just added the quantity of water I needed for my soup. So what I have to do now is to add palm oil, a red oil. So that is the quantity of oil just added. So we just have to cover this for it to boil for about 30 minutes. Then we check again. So guys, um, I'll be showing you guys uh, what I want to use in cooking uh, this um, native soup and boom, look at it uh i don't know the name <laughs> i've tried looking for the name of this thing i like forgetting the name of this but you can get to the market if you know the name please drop it on the comment section just drop it on the comment section drop the name on the comment section just if you go to the market you can see it. all those people selling native something native things in the market just when you see it you will just know it you just know it uh, there's one thing about this stuff it gives um it gives taste there is one this wonderful taste it comes with i love it and oh uh, the aroma wow <laughs> i love it that's why i'm using this you will love it just try it <laughs> just try it so like guys let's just check our pot again okay it's boiling just so uh, it's not up to 30 minutes so we just have to cover it again and just wait for it to yeah so you can go to the market and try this out try it you will love it i love the aroma and also the lovely taste it comes with it I love it. Okay, guys, let's <laughs> check out. Okay. We are going to add add our cocoa. Our cocoa. Oh shit. Just added our cocoa. So we just have to cover it. You have to cover it for it to take time to dissolve. You have to just cover it for it to take time to dissolve before we start adding other ingredients inside the pots. Hello guys, so our soup has been boiling for about 30 minutes now. So I'm going to add another two cubes of Maggi. Then I'm going to add our crayfish. This is our crayfish. Yeah. And I'm going to add a fresh pepper. Add a fresh pepper. I have to stir a little. Yes, guys, if you love what you're seeing, give this video a thumbs up. <laughs> Give this video a thumbs up. Wow. Okay, guys, this is what I showed you guys earlier. So I'm going to add it. Then I'm going to add salt. A little bit of salt. Then I'm going to add my leaf, my Oziza leaf. This is the Oziza leaf. So, guys, I just added uh, this thing. So if you love what you're seeing why not give it a thumbs up wow our native soup is ready so you can now bring it down and serve it uh, with semo so guys look at our native soup if you love what you're seeing please give it a thumbs up Please do well to subscribe on this YouTube channel. 
please do it to subscribe so you will see more of these videos wow <laughs> our native soup is ready you can serve it with a bar fufu semovita wheat whatever thing swallowable native soup this is our wonderful delicious native soup wow if you love what you're seeing give it a thumbs up <laughs> give it a thumbs up please <laughs> wow it's looking nice right yeah please try this at home try this at home try this at home a delicious 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 A delicious